Ooh, Hello Kitty sheet mask time. Okay, I have my Cream Shop Hello Kitty forehead wrinkle warrior patch on and I also have my hydrogel lip patch on. Love it. Hello my Hello Kitty fans, this is Hello Gabius and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell notification and like this video. In today's video, spring is here and we are enjoying our fabulous holiday. Easter is coming right around the corner. It's already a few days away. Easter is April 17th and that's on a Sunday. And of course with Easter and everything that is festive for Easter, we are all in the hunt for Hello Kitty stuff, right guys? And uh, fortunately I'm not able to find a lot of stuff. I just found one item in at Walmart actually and that is actually an Easter basket. And that is pretty much all that I found here in El Paso. Maybe I'll have a better luck next time. But first, I do wanna show you some Happy Mail I got. I did get one package. I got it about a month ago and I just wanted to share it with you guys. I absolutely love what I got. And this is the package here. Yay! And this is from Miss McGarry and uh, I am so happy every time I receive items from her uh, because she always sends me the sweetest things. She sent me a little pouch and first item is an envelope and it says to Hello Gabbiest and I really like the flower details on it and she also put some washi tape here that is a flowers. And so she included her, a letter to me and I will keep that private. Now along with the rest of the goodies. Ooh, so it looks like I got some yellow owls. Ooh. So let's see what this is. And these are two earrings and a necklace set and they are owls. This is just beautiful. Let me show you up front. Look at how pretty that is. They're yellow, perfect color tone for spring. Uh, who knows, maybe I'll wear this for Easter. That is just beautiful. This is the back of the earrings here and then same for the necklace owl and then the chain is here. Ooh, I love it. Thank you so much. Let's see what else I got. So I got a little Hello Kitty tin. And I like these because uh, the majority that come in are uh, filled with candy. And even if you use up the candy because it's a tin, they're very versatile. So you definitely do not want to throw these away. And now I got me a little Hello Kitty container here. I love this. Thank you, thank you. Let's see what else. Ooh, so I got like a lip balm. Hello Kitty lip balm. Really cute. Let's see. Huh. I got a watch and the face is a small face and uh, the Hello Kitty has a pink flower on her head. Let me just show you the watch. Really pretty and the straps are red. Really nice, wow, a watch. Now I gotta be honest, um, I haven't worn any other watch other than my iWatch for like three, four plus years, ever since iWatch came about. So uh, now I depend on my iWatch so much that I have neglected all of my other watches. I have like 10 watches and I have not used because I'm just so uh, into my iWatch. However, um, 
I already own Hello Kitty watches and I love that I can include this in my Hello Kitty jewelry collection. Thank you. Love my watch. Ooh, and then one more item and these are Hello Kitty birthday candles and there's six candles. I don't think I've seen these candles before. And so there's three designs, one with Hello Kitty, and then the middle are uh, birthday presents, and then the bow. And there's two of each. Really cool. And so my birthday did pass this February, and also Miss McGarry did send me a birthday card for that. So thank you, thank you, Miss McGarry, for that. And that is all for my happy mail. I absolutely love the package I got. Thank you so much, Miss McGarry, for your warm thoughts and your wonderful gifts to me. Hey guys, so here in my room, and I want to put my awesome new Hello Kitty watch here in my display case and just quickly the little uh, flower on hello kitty's face of uh, really pretty rhinestones is also on the strap i just noticed it and look at on this buckle as well how pretty is that guys i love it so this is my display case and if you guys have seen already my room tour or not go ahead and click the link above so you can see my room tour everything that i have here uh in my hello kitty room so let's go ahead and open up this case i want to show you where i'm gonna put this new awesome edition i'm not i'm not gonna wrap it on anything i'm just gonna display it here but just so you know this is a, a hello kitty watch my daughter gave me i bought this for myself and here's just some quick jewelry here a little medallion that one of my best friends gave me a long time ago and um i have other jewelry uh, around here but this is where I'm going to put my new awesome Hello Kitty watch so this haul like I said I found this just one item for Easter and that is an Easter basket I was so happy that I actually found an Easter basket normally I do get my Hello Kitty Easter baskets from Walmart uh, luckily uh, there was only one left uh, this year when I went and uh, I'm glad that I got it because I, I saw it, I put it in my basket and then I still looked around to see if there was anything else relating to Hello Kitty and there was nothing else, not even another Easter basket. So last one was mine and this is the Easter basket that I got. And uh, I really love how they make the Easter baskets look like they're just massive. Uh, this Easter basket is really light, just so you know. Really, really, really light. And um, here on this side, it does show the price. The tag is back here. And the price was $22.98. I don't remember what the price was for last year's Hello Kitty Easter Basket. If you guys know, will you let me know how much you paid for Hello Kitty Easter Basket from Walmart? Now, um, it does give nutritional value for the candy that's included in here. And this is the design. And I thought it was going to be, I'm glad that it's a different design. I'm always for them changing the design of Hello Kitty and not just carrying the same design over and over. That's a little boring and they need to be a little bit more, uh, you know, different, a little bit with more diversity in their designs for a Hello Kitty. So, um, but I absolutely love everything that's included in here. I want to open it so I can take it apart so I can show you exactly what's included in this $22.98 Hello Kitty Walmart Easter Basket. Okay, so and so far this is what I have and this is the tag. And it's attached to the pink bow, but let me just show you the tag here. This is definitely a keeper. I do like to keep my tags. Yes, yeah, a nice pretty pink satin bow there. And with all of this probably miles and miles of uh, tape that this has, it's all in one piece. 
me just show you really quickly. So obviously the main toy or the main theme of this Easter basket is this, uh, I guess it's like a, a little beach ball, I wanna call it. A and little. so now let's take it apart so we can see exactly the goodies that it has inside. So off the bat, I was able to snip off some candy. This is Welch's fruit snacks. And then there's Skittles. Cool, can't go wrong with these two items. Let's see what else. Okay, so second item I was able to detach from all of this tape mess is a bubble solution. So this is for you to, um, you know, the kids to throw little bubbles. And so this is pr pretty much a typical item, I wanna say. And I wanna say that last year's Easter basket also included an item such as this. And uh, I really like it, I love the color. So cool, a little bubble. And then, I was able to tear off and they are stickers and there's 15 stickers on here and I really love the uh, Easter theme that they have. Hello Kitty stickers. Cool, really pretty. This is the back of it. Okay, let's see what else. Ooh, so these two things are a two-piece jumble chalk set and it looks like it could be pink and yellow and these are especially fun because whenever I have my little nieces and nephews or friends that also have little kids uh, in my backyard or in my patio it's all cement and this is perfect they can pretty much draw right on the cement and it's fine and they get entertained and it's a lot of chalk so I really, really like this. Cool, so two pieces of chalk. Okay, so we have two sets of the petal and ball. So this is one. And this is the other one. And I'm gonna open one. And uh, as you can see, you do see Hello Kitty there. And this is very flimsy. Very, very flimsy, no image on the back. Um, and it's just a toy. And the ball, um, I'm not sure how, how effective this little paddle is going to be, uh, being that you can easily puncture through it, but that's okay because it's a kid's toy, it doesn't matter. It's just to keep them entertained for a while, I guess, for Easter. So we got two sets of the Paddle and Ball set. And we also got, it says cut out standee. So this is perhaps maybe a decoration for the table. And you do see a little rabbit with a flower here. And then you see Hello Kitty on this side as well and then here I'm not sure if you can see are the actual instructions to set this up so I believe also that last year Easter basket also included something like this and something like this is also uh, I favor these things because I can also decorate my wall with these items little cutout standee of Hello Kitty too and then last thing I was able to pull out is the pink ball. Really pretty ball, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. And this is a 2022 Sanrio product and it is from Mega Toys. And I also own a previous ball uh, from previous years, like I said. Um, it was also a ball themed Easter basket. So cool, a ball, really cute. And then what I am left with is the, pretty much the cutout and the frame that, you know, they taped everything on this basket, all of the cardboard. And um, 
What I want to do is try to at least keep the bottom because you can use this as storage if you keep it like, like a paper bucket. I can put stuff inside it so I'm going to try to cut it out to where I don't damage this uh, you know, rectangular bucket. So I can keep it. It's in great condition. So I want to see what I can do so that I won't have to throw all of the packaging away. I was able to take the top off. So it's just inserted in here. Lots of tape. Ooh, see, so this was inside. And you get a perfect little bucket, like I said. And I like to keep this too. Yay. You can put a lot of items in here and normally I like the others that I have saved. I keep them in the closet and I put like the tote bags that I've purchased and I like to put them in here. Cool. Hi guys and just to show you my closet really quickly what I mean about the um, those Easter bu buckets that I like to save the paper. I like to put totes here so this is my closet and I like to think that I'm trying to organize it as best as I can but I do need more so this is two are from previous uh, years and um, see so this one fits perfectly so this new one that I just got I can then move this box somewhere else and then move this one in here and maybe I can fit uh, more items here so or I'll put it here so that I can fit more totes on top of these buckets and so that is uh, kind of what I do uh, there's a method to this madness I swear uh, but that is what I mean about I don't like to throw some of these items away because they're just so useful especially when you're trying to organize so um it's very messy but uh i am gonna use these buckets to store items in here in this closet so hoping that it will look good at some point okay so lastly we are left with just this frame here i don't know if i'm going to keep this um there's like a lot of tape and Unfortunately, if you peel it off, you're going to tear off some of the image on the cardboard. So, um, I don't know. What do you think? What do you think I should do with it? Will you comment down below and let me know what ideas you have for me to keep this? What I can do uh, with this sign here? So, this is what we ended up with, guys. So, we ended up with a ball. We ended up with a cutout stand we ended up with candy a bubble set we got two jumble chalks two paddle sets and some stickers and lastly i'm keeping this little uh, bucket here so in total there were nine items so out of these nine items for 22 dollars and 98 cents pretty much 23 dollars um I, I don't know that if it's worth it, but again, uh, with such limited retail items, with such limited merchandise for Hello Kitty, um, I think that I can just, I'll take anything that I can get for Hello Kitty. And Walmart seems to be the surest thing for me to find, especially for an Easter basket for Hello Kitty. So, but I'm very happy with it. Um, I wish that they would make next year's theme something different other than including a little beach ball. Maybe something with tin. I love to have tin containers because I can put those on my wall so I can keep those forever. Um, but other than that, I'm really happy with this basket. Uh, let me know what you think and let me know, did you also get a Hello Kitty Easter basket? I want to thank you so much for watching this video. Please give this video a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that bell notification to notify you of when I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you a happy and safe Easter.